Let x be a positive random variable. Prove these two inequalities. Uh, we will use Jensen's inequality for the first question. Let fx equal to 1 over x plus 1. The first order derivative of f is equal to negative x plus 1 to the power of negative 2. The second order derivative of f is equal to 2 times x plus 1 to the order uh, to the power of negative 3. According to the problem, x is a random variable that's positive, so that means the range of x is equal to from 0 to infinity, and it positive, uh, it's a positive number. So here, th the second order derivative of f must be greater than 0 when x is in the range of x. Now, because the second order derivative is greater than 0 on Rx, so that means fx is convex on Rx. So this in, so we can apply Jensen's inequality. So by Jensen's inequality, E f x is going, is going to be greater than or equal to f e of x. So this means expected value of 1 over 1 plus x is greater than or equal to 1 over 1 plus e x. Okay, let's go to the second question. Let g x equal to x over x plus 1. We're going to write this as x plus 1 minus 1 divided by x plus 1. This is equal to 1 minus 1 over x plus 1. And this is equal to 1 minus f x. Now, if we, we take a second derivative of g, and this is equal to negative f, second derivative of f. Now, we showed that the second order derivative of x is greater than 0 when x is in Rx. So this means this is less than 0 when x is in Rx. Now this implies g of x is concave on Rx. And this implies negative gx is convex on Rx. X. Now, by Jensen's inequality, we have expected value of negative g x must be greater than or equal to negative g e of x. So this implies the expected value of g x must be less than or equal to g e x and this is just expect value of x over x plus 1 is less than or equal to e of x divided by e of x plus 1. Thank you for watching.